what's going on guys? Your boy X and today we're doing our Tokyo Revengers episode 16 live reaction. Last we left off, Takamichi got pulled to uh, Valhalla's base. Well, not pulled, but he went of his own free will because Baji was going to be there. He saw Baji beat the shit out of a member. <laughs> and uh, apparently Takamichi was just sent there to be a witness, uh, basically a testimony to say that Baji chose to go to Valhalla of his own will or whatever, you know, just to see if he wasn't a spy or something like that. Like I said, I don't know why they chose Takamichi to be that person person to like you know be like that uh witness or whatever but i guess um and then also we got a little bit with all well, the starting point i guess to the backstory of how Toman was formed i guess so like when everybody was there uh so i think today's episode is probably gonna like dive more into that like what happened to tone like how it start like how it, how they built it and then i guess like the friction that happened between um i forgot what his name is but the one that left originally so let's go ahead and get started remember though guys for more tokyo revengers live reactions slash reviews make Make sure you hit the subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel. You already know check it to that 40 can above. Hit that subscribe button. Join the fam. It's free. Alright, I'm about to begin this, guys, in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's get it. Okay, there we go. Hmm. <laughs> We're at the beach, bitches! What is the beach episode or something? <sighs> the hell am I supposed to... Look at this fool! Driving a bootleg ass. Is that, is that even a motorcycle? all I can afford guys sorry all right we're back <clears throat> once upon a time this is a moped a street talk <laughs> no like a moped I was making like, isn't that a moped shit Uh oh. <laughs> the boy changed his whole eh, you know I don't need to hit your bike it's cool I bet as he's driving off right now he's like oh shit that, that kid's eyes was fucking freaky I gotta get the hell out of here I don't know, I'm stupid, so I don't care what we do. Mm, mm, mm. You know, I remember back in the day, I used to want to, I used to want to ride a motorcycle. But as I became an adult, I started to realize, nah, nah, there's nothing wrong with motorcycles. I just, boy, I don't want to risk my life, man. <laughs> People, especially here, people be driving crazy as hell. Maybe if I was like in a in a car safe <laughs> car safe state, maybe. Here, I don't know. It's too much traffic, man. 
Wow. <laughs> Thomas is a zero again now. Wow. Well, I mean, were they just gonna leave him there? I, why don't they just get like one of them gas cans? Somebody just drove to the gas station. Hmm, I guess you wouldn't be able to hold it on the motorcycle unless, oh, it is the beach episode. Hot damn, now this is how you do it. Forget My Hero Academia's beach episode. Beach episode! Beach episode! Let's go! Every anime has to have one. It's a fact. Even when you think they don't even got a beach, beach episode, somehow. People are dying. We're trying to save the goddamn future. Beach episode. Who cares? <laughs> oh, Lord. I see they didn't touch the moped though. Mm -mm -mm. This poor fool doesn't know what he's getting himself into. Crazy man, where did all of his rage come from? Cause like here, he doesn't even seem like it yet, compared to him in the future. Oh yeah, Mikey about to whip all this. I forgot my swim trunks. Well, I mean, uh, it's kind of a waste of money. I'm trying to figure out what's the point of that. What was the point of that? <laughs> You're the one who wrecked your own. <laughs> I'm guessing he's talking about Baji. It has to be. Hmm, that's why he kicked him, okay. <laughs> Murder them all. I mean, as soon as I saw somebody get roundhouse kicked, oh, well, not even roundhouse kicked, just like regular kick to the head and had them rolled out, I mean, I think, honestly, if I was them, I would have left. An invincible badass. 2003.
I mean, he kicked. He kicked his. I could have had it. What was that about? Was he mad that they were having a birthday party or something? I, what was that? I gotta wait. There's something about that. Seeing how this is going, I mean, he already seems like a delinquent. Well, I mean, they're all delinquent, but I mean, you know what I mean, a bad, bad delinquent. They kind of have honor, so I would, that's what I'm trying to say. Now, how are they getting in here is my question. Huh. I... I never thought to do that. I mean, I'm not a thief, but I never thought to put tape over the glass so that would protect... That's interesting. Hmm. Oh, as a matter of fact, I don't think I've ever seen that in in like any form of media or nothing. It's kind of stupid though because that looks like it's the only one, right? And if they're in this city, obviously, if they see, like, the police or somebody sees them, they're like, oh, I mean, obviously, that's it. That's the person. It's the only one. What kind of store doesn't have an alarm? I mean, that's all. I was like, wait a minute, this is a silent alarm going off, but. <laughs> We're getting robbed? <sighs> Is he 
later? I mean, oh well, shit. What will you do? Oh shit. And he looked too happy to do it too, yeah. Wow, this fool is crazy. Wow, I mean, I took a turn. I mean, this is actually bringing up some crazy confusion now, considering he left for Valhalla if he did this. Because, I mean, honestly, back here, it looks like Baji has some damn common sense to a degree. That's crazy. So, they were still in technically what looked like it was going to be for, like, anyway. Okay, wait, uh, first of all, I might be tripping here because I forget. Is the number for 911 uh, complicated in Japan or something? Did this nigga just push one? Oh, the cops are there. Uh, no, I really want to know. Somebody in the comment section, please let me know. In Japan, is the number to 911 a complicated number? Here in the United States, 911. I just, I don't, please let me know. Because the way he said, what's the number again? Oh, shit. I need to kill Mikey. What the hell? Wow. 
So did he die? Because, I mean, we haven't seen him in the present. I, well, they had to because Baji was still. This is interesting now because Baji was there. All right, so man, a good ass episode. Um, this like even the simple episode somehow fucking shocks everywhere. God damn. Um, <laughs> and to think we almost had a complete beach episode tragedy. Uh, <laughs> so we got a little bit more with the past, you know how um, you know everybody, you know, like they start the little gang off and you know a little fun here and there, making fun of Mikey because he's over here riding a mo uh, a, a moped instead. Everybody else ride fucking motorcycles and shit. That was funny. Um, apparently his birthday. Cause this is kind of a simple episode to a degree. Uh, there was uh, I'm gonna get him ahead of myself too, you know, cause back when they were driving, cause they were going to the beach or whatever, and you know, Mikey ran out of fucking gas, which was funny, cause like the person that lost rock paper scissors had to go get gas for him. <laughs> I guess cause he's a leader, I don't know, but anyways, Baji lost, so he had to go get gas. And earlier they had ran into a gang, but Mikey's eyes scared him off. But they caught Baji's uh, lacking. And they start jumping him, of course. And Baji's a real one because, like, they were about to, like, they had beat him up. Kind of, uh, I don't want to say badly because it didn't look like he was bleeding or nothing. Just, like, kind of bruised up. But, uh, I wouldn't even say bruised up. Just little scuffles here and there. But they were about to start beating up Mikey's moped. And he hopped in the way of the bat. Got hit. And I was like, oh, shit. Right? And then, luckily, Mikey, he came because he's a muscle. And he had forgot his, um, his bathing suit. <laughs> it was swim trunks or whatever. Oh, spin there with swim trunks. And so, you know, he kicks the moped because he's like, you know, uh, I'm sorry that this stupid thing caused, you know, my friend to get hurt or whatever. You know, talking about Baji. And both him and Baji, they didn't show it, but uh, apparently they, I guess they whooped their ass because in the, uh, the narration, I think Baji says, like, uh, back then Mikey wasn't in, uh, invincible or something like that. So I guess they whooped their ass, right? Um, later, though, uh, apparently Mikey's birthday was coming up, right? And uh, Kur Kuratora, right? Kuratora, he basically was like, you know, he telling Baji, hey, uh, let's, uh, like, uh, you know, his birthday's coming up. I already know what I'm gonna try to get him. It's, uh, uh I forgot the damn name of the bike. It's that motorcycle bike that he really wants. And, you know, Baji's like, oh, shit, really? And so they're driving to the store. Now, what's interesting, real quick, before I get into the rest of it, when they were at the, I think they were at the stoplight, right? And uh, Kuratora, he looks over to the left, and there's like a family that is like having a birthday party, I guess, or whatever. And he gets mad for some reason. He's like, he's like, and then like he turns around happy to body, but you know, like he gets mad looking at them for some reason. And I don't know if it's because like I don't know if he has a family. I, I don't know if he has a family, like some kind of like it tri triggered him somehow. So I guess we'll find that out later on, but some reason he got mad looking at that but basically they get to the store and it's like in the front window basically for display and uh, he's like well hey Baji let's go ahead and steal it and Baji's like whoa wait a minute Mikey wouldn't allow that you know stealing is wrong and I like this because this actually shows back in the day that Baji and maybe even in recent time because I don't want to say because we only saw a little bit of Baji in like I'm gonna say I don't want to say present time but you know like in the present past or whatever you know what i mean so we always seen a little bit with baji 
so I can't really say too much. He just seems like he's hot headed and like very violent. But here in the past, this man, the flashback, this man is smart. He's like, you know, hey, you know, still is wrong and all that. Like, I feel like everybody has honor in this group, right? Uh, but Kurt was like, ah, oh, come on, man, you know, Mikey will be real happy to get this motorcycle, blah, blah, blah. So he kind of peer pressured him into helping him steal the bike. They get to the shop, they get to the shop, and I've never seen this before. Like I said, in all the movies, TV shows, everything that I've seen, even like fucking uh, true crimes, uh, <laughs> true crime documentaries, I have never seen somebody tape a window and punch it and it makes sense in my mind because like I feel like the tape would uh, call, like it would stop the glass from like you know falling or whatever when it breaks and causing like a noise and shit also protecting your hand As I've never seen that I was like oh shit wow so they, they break that they break in you know they're getting the uh the, they're getting the bike to cut the uh, the lock that's around the wheel and uh Chris was like let me go check the uh, let me go check the back uh you know be the stake out or whatever or whatever and uh turns out the shop owner is still there i uh, don't know if he lives there or whatever or maybe he was working on something but you know he's all like uh, y'all trying to steal in my shop what the hell and he gets up closer and he notices, he recognizes, like, wait, Baji, is that you? Uh, and then, so Baji, he didn't say anything, but he starts to say his name. And then all of a sudden, you know, uh, Kurotaro comes back in the background. And then Baji tries to tell him to stop, but he was too late. And he smacked him in the head um, with the damn, uh, fuck, <laughs> the damn cutters. And knocked his ass clean out. Now, I'm curious because they did not say he was dead they didn't say that he was dead they just said that he was rushed to the hospital uh but in uh present past time we haven't seen him nor was he ever mentioned i don't believe so if to my knowledge i might be wrong with that y'all can let me know in the comment section but they never said he died at least yet so um but i mean it did look like he was losing a lot of blood so i don't know but uh baji Common sense, once again, like I said, Baji seems to be, at least back in the day, he was like a good guy, you know? He was like, we gotta call an ambulance, man. This is fucking, this is fucking Mikey's brother. And I was like, oh shit, like the mic drop, Mikey's brother. So yeah, um, turns out they knocked it. The hell is that? Oh, <laughs> they turned, knocked his ass out and he tries to call the ambulance. But uh, before that, the police were there. Now, during all of this, you know, Kurtzoy was like, Mikey's mother, oh my god, I didn't mean to do this. I was doing all this for Mikey, oh my god. And, like, he basically have a nervous breakdown, and all of a sudden he's all like, the only way, the only way this all makes sense, I have to kill Mikey. And I'm like, what the hell? Like, how do you, how do you come, how do you come to that conclusion? That's like, two plus two is five. What the hell are you talking about? You gotta kill Mikey now. Uh, so... Yeah, the police get there, arrest both Baji and uh, Kuratora, and you know Mikey gets to the scene of the crime like right as they're like about to get her like put in the cop cars or whatever. And Baji breaks down, starts crying, tells him he's uh, sorry that this happened, and that's how the episode ends, man. Like every episode of Tokyo Revengers has been fucking amazing. Even I thought this was about to be a simple episode and even at the end they pull on your heartstrings. We ain't even I, I didn't even know this man had a brother. I'm telling you I don't remember them mentioning that but like that was a nice little shock. Now I do have a question though because like I said if I'm Mikey I'm putting, my, I'm putting myself in Mikey's shoes real quick. If I'm Mikey and Kuratora and, and Baji had uh involvement i say involvement because technically baji didn't kill him you know if he's if he's dead uh we don't know yet if he's dead but i'm saying if i'm mikey and both of them uh injured my bro i'll just say that injured my brother right granted you know they were they were you know trying to steal a bike for his birthday or whatever tech and what was funny is since that since that was his brother's shop because I, I think they did mention that that was a, that I guess the bike was a, like gonna be for Mikey, right? Uh, that, that's crazy, but because uh, they did say it was a custom job, but yeah, yeah. Uh, if I'm Mikey, I would not let them on the team. Uh, the team, I would not let them in the gang anymore. They're trying to kill my brother. I'm not letting them in the gang. But like I said, Baji, from what we saw, was uh, he was there. He was in there 
Um, granted, they said that he had been gone for a while or something like that, but he was still in the game. So, yeah, I don't, I don't, I, mean, I would assume his brother's alive because if his brother died, I wouldn't have let them, do, I wouldn't let them fools back in. I'm sorry, but yeah, so that's the only reason why. And as far as with Kuratora, um, I feel like he probably after this moment, because I'm I'm sure they're about to go to jail or whatever. Uh, but I'm sure he leaves the group. Either he leaves the group, or Mikey's all like, uh, you know what? F you, you hurt my brother. Yeah, you outie, you outie. Baji, it's debatable with him. Like it, he might, he might, but Mikey might let it slide with him because I think they're like real cool. I mean, but I think Mike is cool like with all of them. But I feel like with Baji, he's like real cool with Baji. And like I said. As far as with Baji, he uh, he didn't, you know, attack his brother. You know, he tried to stop it. In fact, and call it. Tried. We wanted to call an ambulance and stuff. So, man, this is tough, man. This is. I need more. I need more. This this flashback is pretty interesting right now. Like, I'm I'm very curious what the next episode is gonna hold. But yeah, that's all, guys. Remember for more Tokyo Revengers live reaction slash reviews, and make sure you have the subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel. Hit the bell to get notified when I drop my videos also follow me on instagram twitter my facebook game page and the discord all of them in the description box below if you like the video guys like the video comment let me know what your favorite part episode was and as always guys it's been your boy x and i'm out deuces